Hello, my name is Jeff Goodwin, and I'm a Link Technical Specialist for Microsoft. During this presentation, I'll talk about what's new from a client perspective with Link 2013. Since we have limited time for the presentation, I'll focus only on the primary enhancements. So with that, let's get started. Link 2013 builds upon the strengths of Link 2010. The essence of Link 2013 is captured in these four pillars. The first is multi-party HD video and content sharing. Link 2013 showcase advances in video and visual communications. I see what you mean takes on an entirely different meaning when colleagues and customers from down the hall, across town, or around the globe can see each other's gestures while hearing their tone. The next release of Link further delivers on the promise of access anywhere, ensuring that Link is available anywhere a user has access to Windows 8 PC or tablet, mobile device, or browser. Modern, mobile, and web client investments allow Link to be where the users are putting people at the center of communications and collaboration. Link was built from the ground up to deliver identity-based communications, pivoting on a user's identity rather than the old paradigm of using phone numbers as a proxy for a person. Link integration across Office apps enables one-click communications directly from within the productivity applications used by information workers every day. Link is integrated into Outlook, SharePoint, OneNote, and other Microsoft applications. Federation with Skype unlocks the potential to bring all these investments mentioned and the rich communication and collaboration scenarios they enable to hundreds of millions of users worldwide. Let's take a closer look at each one of these investment areas. With the new gallery view, you automatically see everyone in the link meeting via a continuous view of multiple HD video streams or photos. The video gallery scales to provide the best experience for a diverse set of scenarios, including point-to-point -point video call, a small group collaborative session, or the presentation style sessions, showing the most relevant people in the meeting at all times by bringing the five dominant speakers video into focus to the standing row and displaying the thumbnail photos of less active participants in the sitting rows. Link uses industry standards, including H.264 SVC, to enable the multi-party HD video experience across a range of devices. Photos replace video streams if the quality does not meet or exceed minimum standards set by administrators. When scheduling a meeting, the organizer can select a dedicated space or create a new meeting room with a new ID and password. Customizing the meeting options allows the link meeting to serve a unique set of requirements, facilitate a more formal or structured meeting type, or manage the experience for participants themselves. For example, if you have external participants, specific presenters, or confidential information to discuss, a meeting organizer might want to leverage the lobby and create a more controlled meeting space. De depending on the type of size of the meeting, you can now decide if you want to mute the audience and allow or block video sharing when scheduling. During the meeting, presenters need to focus on their delivery and the participants and not be distracted with the meeting administration. Link now uses peaks to provide more functionality with less clutter. Peaks are buttons that are revealed when you hover over certain areas of the Microsoft Link meeting window. For example, hover over the monitor icon to see all the options for sharing and managing content. Hover over the telephone icon to see mute and hold options. Hover over the three dots on the right to see more options. Meeting view options are designed to bring content and people together while optimizing the link meeting experience for every individual participant's needs. The meeting view is selected by the participant and visible only to them. Each participant has control of their meeting view. Gallery view shows all the participants' photos or videos. Speaker view shows the meeting content with the, presenter, with the presenter's video or photo in the light, lower right-hand corner of the meeting window. Presentation view shows only the meeting content you get a full view of the content, but you won't see the participants. Compact view shows only the participants' photos. Just hover over a photo to see their contact information. Link mobile clients enable users to make and receive calls using a single consistent link identity and join link meetings from a mobile device with a single touch while avoiding long numeric passcodes or pins from the native calendar application. The feature set continues to rapidly evolve in Link 2013 Time frames, time frames with VoIP over wireless and video over wireless. Link voice and video over IP experiences, including peer-to-peer -peer and link meetings, will be supported on Windows Phone, iPhone, iPad, 
application and desktop sharing for the Link Metro style app and iPad are planned as well. The Link web app allows PC and Mac users to join a Link meeting from within an HTML5 based browser and delivers a full Link meeting experience, including multi-party HD video, voice over IP, instant messaging, desktop, application and PowerPoint sharing. Link web app eliminates the need to install client software by using a browser-based client to join and participate in Link meetings from a shared device or PC, internet cafe, a personal home device or kiosk. External clients, partners, and customers can join Link meetings with Link web app, eliminating the need to download and install the Link attendee client previously shipped with Link 2010. With Link, information workers use a single unified client to manage all communications, including voice video calling, multimedia conferencing, and instant messaging. A simple instant message can be escalated to a Link meeting with video conferencing at any time from a single unified client. Deep integration with Office apps enables instant communication and collaboration with colleagues, customers, and partners from directly within their most frequently used productivity apps. Link is part of the Office suite and has best of breed integration in the Office family. For example, PowerPoint presentations are shown natively in the Link experience, providing the highest fidelity and performance possible. The contact card is a dynamic resource that displays a contact's high resolution photo, their presence, status note, location, and organizational details, and is consistent across Microsoft Office applications. Link users see their contact's availability in real time, chat, and move quickly between active conversations and link meetings. With the contact card, link users can bring together information from internal and external networks, for example, SharePoint, LinkedIn, and Facebook, into a single card for each person in the contact list. OneNote is now directly integrated into Link for taking meeting notes and recording attendance. Whiteboard sketches and slide annotations can also be saved into OneNote notebooks. OneNote Share allows users to create and share OneNote digital meeting notes within a Link meeting, reducing errors caused by later transcription and simplifying communication and follow-up. We continue to make major voice improvements with Link 2013, including Voice in the Cloud, hybrid voice, support for IPv6, session management, delegation enhancements, including shared line appearances, expanded capabilities from call routing with multiple gateways, We're also very excited about the acquisition of Skype. Skype celebrated its eighth birthday in August 2011 and has achieved a great deal of milestone in its short history. Here are some highlights. 20% of international calling minutes combining PSTN and Skype to Skype are Skype to Skype minutes. Skype has 170 million average monthly connected users and at peak times, approximately 30 million concurrent users are logged into Skype. In 2010, of the 207 billion voice and video minutes, of which 43% were video. Skype is also growing twice as fast as the world's population. At its highest level, Link and Skype are very complementary. Connecting to Skype endpoints from Link will enable rich communication with hundreds of millions of people from business grade tools, reduce costs through simplification and integration, and allow IT to take control of cameras consumerization of IT while giving employees what they want. Skype brings its customer base, products, and peer-to-peer -peer network. Link has been designed from the ground up for the enterprise with its full range of enterprise class features and IT pro focus. To be clear, Skype is our consumer-based product. Link is the enterprise-based product. Integrating Skype across the Microsoft portfolio is an ambitious effort and a long-term investment. Ultimately, Skype will become an essential ingredient across the Microsoft portfolio of products and will positively impact the character and bottom line of every division in the company. In the near term, Federation with Skype will allow Link 2013 users to connect to anyone on Skype, enabling communication with hundreds of millions of people around the world. Capabilities will include presence, instant messaging, and voice. We intend to go beyond these capabilities and, and unlock the full value of Link and Skype together with video as our next priority.
Bringing Skype into the Microsoft family strengthens the link value proposition for businesses of all sizes, and Microsoft remains as committed as ever to enterprise unified communications.